fighting in Boston on January 18th. I was ready for Costa, you know, the mindset, me being angry with that first loss. I'm not taking it lightly, you know, I know it's his debut and he's hungry and, you know, I thank him for taking the fight, but I'm hungry too. And I'm at a point now where it's like certain things are starting to click, you know, everything is just clicking, you know, and I'm ready, man, I'm going all the way. I've been training in Orange County at Rain and um, mixing it up with Jason Manley and my uh, strength and conditioning coach, John Walker. So I've been out there for a good, I would say, three months, you know, and uh, prior to that, I came out there for my toe injury to recover. And I figured, let me just start camp early, you know, why not just stay in shape, stay ready? I got the call for the fight, pushed a little harder. Then I decided to come out to uh, Vegas to finish up with Coach Clayton uh, Hires. I'm an extreme couture, great environment, um, great guys, tough guys. I broke my toe last fight and it was grueling, it sucked, but me personally, man, I don't mind that adversity, you know, because it, when I overcome that, I feel invincible. And I know a lot of people are doubting my abilities and saying that I'm too nice and all that, but it goes to show you don't really know someone until I guess they're backed in a corner. And I've been in that situation before where, you know, I broke my hand in a fight and my coach told me all right you can't use your left hand punch him in the face with your right hand and i went out there and i did it but you know for me it's just again overcoming that adversity for me you know it's hard for a lot of people to understand man that's why you have fans <laughs> my goal for 2015 is to be more productive you know be more organized get more fights in maybe like three or four for the year just to stay more active uh, i feel i can grow better and again, it's a, it's a step closer towards greatness. This is Uriah Hall. Be sure to tune in my fight on January 18 in Boston. And you're watching MMA interviews with the one and only Spencer Lazara. <laughs>